Linda Nolan has branded herself the Naughty Nolan as she took to social media to share a series of jaw-dropping braless snaps. The 64-year-old singer, who is currently battling cancer, has been lamenting on times gone by as she took to Instagram to treat her adoring followers to a trip down memory lane with some unearthed snaps from the height of her music career. The Nolan's hit maker shared two photos, which saw her pose without any bra on in a barely there denim outfit, paired with fishnet tights. Linda who was in her 20s at the time, referred to herself as the Naughty Nolan, admitting that her outfit at the time was a vibe. The singer had her brunette locks styled in the classic 80s voluminous curls as she gazed down the camera seductively. After sharing the iconic throwback snaps, it wasn't long before Linda was inundated with a flurry of gushing comments from her fans. Foxy Nolan more like, one admirer commented, while a second echoed, supermodel material Linda. Um, as gorgeous now as you were then, someone else swooned, while another commented, stunning then stunning now. What a woman, another gushed, and someone else added, the supermodels of today have got nothing on this. Such a vibe. Linda, along with her sister, Anne, Denise, Maureen, Bernie, and Colleen, all shot to fame in the 70s as the Nolan sisters. Following an incredibly successful career in music and TV, Linda was diagnosed with stage 3 breast cancer in 2005 before getting the all clear in 2006, but in 2017 was diagnosed with a form of incurable secondary cancer in her hip which later spread to her liver in 2020. The brave singer recently opened up to Susanna Reid and Richard Madeley on Good Morning Britain to reveal her cancer has spread to her brain in a heartbreaking interview. Last month, Linda told ITV viewers, I've always been hopeful with my treatment and what's going on in my life. I just want to tell you unfortunately for me my cancer has spread to my brain that's obviously frightening because there isn't much treatment for brain cancer except for chemotherapy. Linda explained that she had also been offered a new drug to trial alongside the chemotherapy. I'm not giving up. I'm positive. I'm going to lose my hair again for the fourth time, she added.